Hi everyone, my name is Vasudha. Welcome to my channel. In today's video, I will be sharing my journal collection with you. Some of them are old, some are new and uh, some of them are guided journals. So let's dive in. So this is my first journal and you probably would have seen this in a couple of my videos before. When I came to Delhi, I didn't have too many options, so I just started using this one. And uh, in my last video, I had shared about some art supplies and I used my art line Udle pens for some creative work over here, just for time pass. And I do my usual writing sometimes just random stuff i write over here so this is just a very basic journal that i'm using and i made my first video on reading journal in this one next i have over here is another journal which i had from before and uh, i didn't use it much as you can see it's from 2018 i got it from canada from one of the dollar stores over there i believe this was for just four dollars which comes out to be around 200 rupees or something and it's really good cover the cover is hard and so pretty it's a lined journal so i used to write down some serious thoughts in this one serious thoughts in the sense that something which i have learned something which i am reading about or anything which is not just a simple brain dump or not something which is just you know scribbling so i used to do some writing in this earlier and it comes with an elastic band also so this is very handy and uh, very convenient to use and i liked its yellow papers as well next i have is a coffee journal and this is actually interesting because i made a whole video on my love for books and coffee now i didn't really know that this existed until i reorganized my bookshelf and i have made a video on that before so i discovered that i do have a journal which is completely on coffee theme and uh, i just could not believe that and if you want to know since when i'm journaling you can see over here that since 2012 actually much before than that it's been almost 10 12 years since i'm journaling but this is not again uh, something which i have been using on a daily basis or a regular basis this also comes with an elastic band i don't remember from where i got this one but this is something which now i will be using more of while I sip my coffee. Next is this beautiful pink marble shaded journal. I think not exactly marble shaded but some beautiful design it has on it and this journal has a velvety suede uh, if you know that material it has that cover and it's so gorgeous it's so beautiful and it comes with these buttons and a pencil inside now this was also purchased from canada and i have not started using it there was a sale going on in the indigo bookstore if you remember if you have watched my previous video on book cafes i have mentioned about the indigo bookstore over there and uh, there was a sale going on and i just grabbed this i think for seven dollars or eight dollars i don't remember but i just loved it i thought i'll be using it for my personal journey journaling so this is one journal that i have which i can use for my personal journaling it says 18 dollars oh my god look at that i i can't believe i got this for five dollars so not even seven or nine it was straight five dollars and beautiful logo over here and i just 
love the design it's so pretty and for five dollars means somewhere around 250 rupees it's a steel deal and uh, it has lined pages so that would make journaling easy now moving on to the new journals that I have purchased, one of them is with the initial V and I liked this so much because it gives a little personalized touch to your journaling and especially if you want to make it your personal journal and it has this you know laser cut they call it so it's very pretty and this is available in other initials as well and this is also a lined journal and it also has these beautiful you know designs at the bottom and top of the pages and the color of the pages is also different so you have pink white cream and you know mauve and so on and so forth so this really adds a whole lot of beauty to this journal and perfect for personal journaling i would say this is really the best for personal journaling you can also obviously use it for different other purposes and this is by the brand doodle they have a lot of interesting uh, journals on available on amazon so you might want to check them out too and in fact they also have given a whole list of you know qualities of uh, associated with each and every letter of the alphabet so this is all to flatter us nothing to be taken seriously next I have got with me a journal specifically for my YouTube ideas I was looking desperately for a journal which had a cover which would suit you know something related to youtube or social media or anything to do with you know creative ideas and i did get a few options but this was the best one uh, for me i like this one the most and uh, it has everything on it so it has youtube facebook and you know all these signs and symbols of social media and digital media so i'm going to use this for exclusively my youtube ideas and uh, this has blank pages now i really wished that this had ruled pages but these are unruled pages so never mind i'm going to still jot down my thoughts in this journal and this has a plain black cover at the back and the good part about this is that it has spiral binding it i mean spiral binding makes it a lot easier to just you know turn the pages or even to tear them off if need be and prior to this i was using a very simple uh, small journal for my youtube ideas and uh, this is the one i think i got from the us many 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 years ago again from one of the dollar stores i don't remember how much was it for but this is really something which had been very handy and i had been using this actually for my book club discussions in delhi i used to have a book club and uh, i used to write down the points I used to write down about whatever important things we used to discuss in our book club so after that but it still had a lot of pages left so I was now using it for my YouTube but I'll be now switching over to this new journal of mine then I have a journal which has an interesting cover of a girl reading a book and this is the most appropriate design for a reading journal and i had been meaning to purchase a proper guided reading journal a pre-printed one but then the price was really high of all book journals reading journals that are available on amazon i think their prices are really high and i was not ready to go for such steep prices so i thought why not create our own reading journal so i got this one and it's a blank journal just like i wanted and this also reminds us a little 
little bit of Frida Kahlo and uh, it has that you know unique Frida Kahlo touch to it so this is something which I'll be using for jotting down my reading list and my books and so on and so forth I created this cover page again using the same art supplies that I have shared with you in my previous video and this is again something I just scribbled. This was not exactly what I had in mind before uh, putting it on paper but it has turned out fine so it's okay and um, I'll also be planning a reading journal video sometime soon and uh, there are a few ideas in my head which i will be executing on this journal and i'll be sharing them with you too and this has again a plain black back cover oh i just noticed this has chipped off so again with spiral and uh, convenient to use and with a nice design as well then I've got for myself a gratitude journal. Now I could not have asked for more in this kind of a journal. It has the right coat. It also has a very nice different color because most of the journals are either too colorful or they come in just plain black and grayish or brown colors but this one was different and it says it all gratitude is the best attitude and this journal is absolutely beautiful it has again off-white sheets it has a place to write your date and uh, beautiful simply you can just go on writing to your heart's content and it has a elastic band also and uh, a pen holder so you can fix your pen over here next is related to the gratitude journal i also got one more blank journal and it says the grass is greener where you water it now oftentimes we've heard the grass is greener on the other side but this quote is something which can be read actually either ways it can be read in a way that uh, be content where you are and uh, be thankful for what you have or it could also be read as do a lot of hard work and your grass will be greener where you are this is also blank from inside and spiral bound and i plan to use it for doodling on happiness on gratitude and so on and so forth it comes with a laminated sheet the reading journal also that I showed you, the journal which I will be using for my reading journal purposes also has a laminated cover and uh, inside they have a matte finish cover. So that is another one. Then I have a few journals which my sister gave me. She gets a lot of these notebooks and diaries from different people so she has passed them along to me very kindly this is one of them again it's blank and uh, this is how it looks it has this little ethnic touch to it which I really like and uh, I'm still to think how to use this journal maybe again to probably paint or doodle I don't know yet but this is one journal which I have with me then she gave me one of these notebooks i would say which has blue color paper inside and uh, most likely only black ink can be used on this so either this can be used for writing something down or again for sketching purpose i don't know i'm yet to think about it if you have ideas please do share with me so plain black color and uh, i can probably think of decorating it with a few stickers and i don't know with some craft supplies once i get hold of my craft supplies which are till now not with me and uh, as soon as i get hold of them i may do something creative with this journal and lastly she's given me this beautiful gorgeous 
look at the design of this journal it's so pretty i always love ethnic stuff so with this uh, block printing and which is golden in color and especially on the dark pink fuchsia color i don't know what exactly it's called especially with this dark color it just looks simply gorgeous and uh, very sturdy very nicely built and it has this you know jute uh, tag on it to tie it up and look at the papers inside the pages are all colored and they are handmade sheets so different shades of paper i really don't know how to make use of this one i don't feel like actually using this one because i think i might spoil it and this is one of the very common problems with journal writers that they feel they will spoil their cute notebooks and diaries and journals so if you have any ideas to share how i can use these three journals which i've just shown you please write them in the comment section below i don't want to just scribble anything and spoil these journals they are so gorgeous and i want to keep them neat and beautiful and do something really special with them so please share your ideas and lastly i have two guided journals with me one of them you've seen already this one i got for my birthday and it's a journal for self realization it's by meera lee patel and uh, i'll just show you this one first and i have shown you the insides of it i've not started using it yet as yet i have been just thinking over some of the thoughts that are written over here some of the prompts that have been written over here i have taken a look at this journal in fact many a times i have seen the questions and still i'm thinking how to frame my answers so this is how this journal looks and you can go back to my previous video and take a closer look at all the gifts that i bought for myself including this mug over there next guided journal i have is a mindfulness journal i am here now it's called and it's a creative mindfulness guide and journal and i have been using this word mindfulness very frequently and i still don't know however how to practice mindfulness so this journal was actually a very good buy in the sense that it shows you how to be mindful and i have been thinking that i am a mindful person but i think i still need to learn a lot about it because when i started reading the prompts in this journal i thought that i need to practice mindfulness much more and uh, they have really interesting prompts and this one particularly i liked on clouded thoughts thoughts come and go across our minds like clouds in the sky some bigger than others some wispy others round some oval maybe a rain cloud so here we are asked to draw some clouds of our own thoughts and write down our thoughts in them and watch them come and go against the blue sky of your mind so really interesting uh, guided journal and uh, if you are interested in practicing mind fullness if you are interested in being more conscious about your present state then probably you can grab this one and this was for i think 450 rupees after discount there was some discount going on so not an expensive purchase so you can probably grab this one and so that was that i mean this was my journal collection i hope you liked it So that was about my journal collection. I hope you liked some of them and uh, do write in the comment section below which ones you liked and please subscribe to my channel if you haven't done already. Please give it a thumbs up if you like this video and share it as well with your friends or whoever you know likes journaling. So until next video, thank you and bye.